Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Then again, maybe it should be you welcoming me back. Regardless, welcome back. So, what's been going on with me recently? It's been around 1.5 months since I made a video, and it's been about 6 months since I played Minecraft. It's been quite surprising and somewhat disconcerting how so many people have jumped onto the Windows 10 edition of Minecraft. And it also seems a shame that the development of Minecraft is pushing towards a game that I'm not really that interested in playing, to be honest. But is this the reason I haven't been making videos? <laughs> not at all. In fact, I have plenty of videos to make, plenty of videos and series that are still being made. However, time at work is draining my free time. This is alright though, because it's mostly self-inflicted. I'm working around 720 hours a year of unpaid overtime, simply because I really enjoy automating. It's not that surprising really. Throughout the whole of my time playing Minecraft, I have loved automation. I have loved taking manual tasks and automating them into something quick, efficient and user friendly. In fact, this was the foundation that this very channel was built on. My love of automation. Over the past few months, you have seen some snippets of what I'm doing now. I'm spending a lot of time in VBA, MatBasic, and AutoHotKey, building software to automate the company's tasks. But what other projects am I working on in my own time, albeit very slowly? Number one, the evolution of a minecart system. The sequel to one of my most treasured series, the evolution of a minecart station. This is what the project looks like at the moment. As you can see, the project is going to exceed one hour of footage. The script is at 40 pages long, and the last two episodes need a complete rewrite. This is one of those ongoing projects, and for now I have stopped work on it. That being said, I hope that one day I will make time to finish it. Number 2. The ScreenFlow API The video editing software I use is a piece of software called ScreenFlow. ScreenFlow itself does not have an API, thus it becomes very difficult to automate any of it. So at some point I decided to create one for myself. I began work on an open source API which you can find on GitHub. At the moment, it's just nuts and bolts as I work on another project, which will greatly improve the speed at which I can create this API. That project is number three, the AppleScript API Builder. This project is essentially going to be a builder that will allow for the quick creation of GUI-based APIs for any Mac application. Sadly, in order to automate Mac applications, you either have to work in Objective-C or AppleScript. Neither language is very attractive, in my opinion. Even still, I'm tearing through AppleScript as best as I can in order to make something decent. But as with everything, it takes time. Back to videos, as you may remember, I did create a Minecraft map with Cellulance and the Gunmaster. I do want to create the video for this, however I am currently waiting patiently for a 1.9 compatible replay mod, if such a mod is ever released that is. That being said, I'm not entirely sure whether Cellulance or the Gunmaster are that interested in the map anymore, or Minecraft for that matter, so we'll just have to see how it goes. Number 5. I was working on a video to be named Sankan's Wishlist, a video where I show things that I believe would benefit the game. I'm not sure whether that video is ever going to come into fruition. 
There are some other projects around, but they're all either minor or work-related. Will these projects ever get finished? Maybe. I don't know. Only time will tell. But I guess until then, thanks for being here. Thanks for waiting, and thanks for watching.